On this video, we're going to be installing a TRD Pro Grill on a 2021 Toyota Tundra. This is from Car Trim Home. Um, I've installed a couple of these on the 5th Gen 4Runner, so this should be relatively easy. So let's go ahead and get into the install. So first thing what's included in the box is going to be the cover for the TSS sensor. What we have next is the Heritage Toyota lettering. This is what it's all about. And lastly you have a plastic cover insert. This one says Tundra on there. So first thing we'll do is to uh, remove all the screws. And then there's gonna be some plastic clips on both sides. You can just use a flathead, go ahead and pop them off easily. Now once you have all the bolts along with the clips removed on top, there's going to be three plastic clips holding the whole thing together. Just going to give it a quick yank and you should be able to pop it right off. So the new grill does come in a black finish, but we're going to go ahead and wrap it in satin black afterwards. Now we're going to disassemble the old TSS sensor. There's just a couple screws and clips that you need to remove. These clips that hold the harnesses in place can be a little bit tricky, but use a flathead and you just go ahead and give it some strength and you're able to just pop them right off. Now we'll add these screw brackets for the TSS sensor. Now line up the TSS sensor. It should just fit one way. Now go ahead and screw down the TSS sensor. Just make sure to carefully do this and not to break any of the plastic tabs. Now go ahead and pop in the TSS sensor cover. You'll hear a quick snap. Then we're gonna go ahead and add a little bracket that's included to keep it in place. Now the spacer nut's supposed to keep the TSS sensor in place. So go ahead and use a flathead and press down all sides until it clamps on. And there's gonna be two of these, so you're gonna repeat the process on both sides. Now pop the harness clips back into the two slots up top. Cool. Now we weren't able to find where the last wire harness clip clips onto. So we're gonna go ahead and clean it up with a zip tie. What I also recommend at this point is using some electrical tape and taping down that green taped area. Uh, we're able to see this afterwards. So I think it's a good time to, to apply the electric tape to clean that up. Now go ahead and line up the Toyota lettering and then we're going to go ahead and flip it upside down so that we can start screwing the emblems back in. Thank you. 
Now there's gonna be eight screws, so, so just carefully drill it in. Just again, be careful not to over tighten, it will strip. So carefully do this and you should be good. Now with everything assembled on the grill insert, we're gonna go ahead and line up the grill and I'm, we're gonna go ahead and push it in place. Now with everything snapped into place, just make sure that all the holes are lined up so that we're able to add in the screw inserts. Here's a look at the larger car trim home cover on the right side. And there you have it guys this is a quick install it took us about 15 minutes we'll drop a link below for the product hope you guys found this video helpful we'll catch you guys on that next one thanks guys